Hello everyone, this is Angie. Welcome to my channel. Today is going to be the part two of de-stashing my stash. And if you haven't seen it already, please check out my, de my stash video from October. It is a really cute thumbnail with a doggy on the front and all the pretty colorful leaves. I'll throw a link up here in the eye and down in the description. I'm still learning how to use those uh, links for eyes, so bear with me on that. So I have gone through today, and I'm gonna throw a, a snapshot up on the screen there, and you'll see that I have, let me check again, because I keep getting it wrong, my stash, my October summary, I had 91, including my whips, in October, and I checked how many I had sold, and I had sold 30 kids since my spring stash video. So, you know, that, when you do that math, that means I would have had 115 in my stash, and you guys, that doesn't make me feel like very comfy. Um, I'm working on setting some goals for myself. I don't want to go on a strict no buy, but I think I have to go on some kind of a plan. So the first step in my plan is to do part two of my de-stash. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through all the kits and show you the boxes and where I don't have a box because, or it's a, not one of the not a dreamer designs or a diamond art club i will open it and show it to you because you might never have seen it before and all the prices are going to be in the google sheet below not on um I'm not going to read them out because they might change and of course the list might change as things sell i'm going to mark them on there so the first one i'm going to show you might be a shocker because <laughs> I don't know. I just decided that I'm going to be tough and I'm going to let some things go. If I don't see myself doing it in the next two years, it's going on the list. If I don't sell it, then I don't sell it and I keep it. So this, guys, is an unopened kit from Diamond Painting Deutschland. This is Josephine Wall's Spirit of Flight. It is 100 by 75 centimeters in in square and i'll throw a picture of the art up here so the price for that will be down below and remember i paid for it in euros and any size of box like the, that comes from there now is a flat rate of 50 euros so i've included what i've paid and then i've you know taken it down a little bit but it's it's brand spanking new so if you're interested in trying a Diamond Painting Deutschland kit, this is a good way to go because there's only one, right? This is this one here. I am thinking about letting another one go, but I haven't decided. I'm on the fence. So, yeah, it might be, I might let Joy de Vivre go. I'm thinking about it, the Diamond Painting Deutschland one, because I have five... Josephine Walls from there and guys I can only do one a year so I might pop another one in the list down below which will be in a google sheet and all the prices will be on the google sheet and they are all plus shipping. Now the good news is that I found a way a freight forwarding company that for the US that takes packages legally it's completely 100 percent legal and they i ship them from here where i live and they take them on their truck and they drop them off across the line in the u.s and they drop into the usps funnel and it's all above board it's all trackable and everything and it's actually way less than canada post canada post is the hugest ripoff in the universe right now it's absolutely ridiculous I won't go there. Anyways, someone bought two kits from me last week on my part one de-stash list, and that was going to cost $75 Canadian. 
when I put it into this other option, which I fully researched, and it's trackable, it was $40 Canadian. That is huge. That is the difference, you know. So for US, that would be like 30 bucks for two large kids. So I mean, it does vary as well. But yeah, this one, I checked it out. And I think it came out, it would be around, oh, I don't want to say if I get it wrong. But if you're interested, let me know. I can put all your details in and get a quote for you on the shipping. Okay, and also to note, I am doing PayPal Goods and Services. So next I have, this is the Mystery Kit by Selena Fenich from Diamond Art Club. It's 56 by 79. And if you know, you know what it is. So that's on the list down below. Then I have Wishing For You. It's a square from Bani Manzano and it'll be listed below. Next, I have a round kit. It's the Princess and the Frog. It's also a Mandy Manzano. It's super cute. So I just had to think about, you know, what, what I work on in the next 18 months and how many more new ones are gonna come out that I wanna buy or promote. So yeah, there's this little one. And then there's the Golden Poppy Fairy. It is Hannah Lynn. And it is around and it is, I believe is discontinued. So this is a, definitely a collector item. She's super cute. This is Shannon by Lori Pringle. It is also around. It is 84 by 56. I love, love, love that image. It's hard to do a D stash guys, but I've got to cut myself down to 50 ish kits. <laughs> Next, I have Goddess of the Butterfly, or Butterfly Wings of the Goddess. There's the toolkits in here, as well as all the drills. Some really nice colors in here. This is a really pretty kit. I actually quite like it, but I don't know when I'm gonna have time. This is um, Lazy River Wood Turning, and you can see that the printing on this is very clear. There's no issues. And it's just super, super pretty. I don't, uh, when I looked on her site, I didn't see this one as available, but I'll just show it to you. It's got um, double-sided legends, and I'll show you that the glue is good too. Actually, the glue is really good. Yeah, so there's just no issues, and it's licensed by Heather Woods, Celestial Moon Fire Art. And it has a box, so this one will be down below. Next, I have Beauty and the Beast. This is a Mandy Manzano and it's 42 by 60. And the next one I have is another Mandy Manzano. This is Rapunzel. It's a round, it's 42 by 60. Um, Beauty and the Beast was also a round. So those would ship really well together because they're a similar size. Along with Golden Poppy Fairy. This kit was a one-time release on Black Friday. This is Embrace Spirit. It's an eagle and it's super cool by Raven Falan. It's a square and it's 43 by 61. And I believe there is either a glow-in-the-dark diamond or a crystal in here. I think it's a glow-in-the-dark. Yeah, it's very cool. So I'll throw a picture of the art up here as well. Next is a big kit. This is square and it is the Dragon's Door by Raven Falan. This is 70 by 99. It's huge and it weighs a lot too. That's a heavy box. In square, guys, this is such a cool image. I just don't know when I'll ever have time to put this on my list. I keep looking at it and going past it and I'm like, it's so cool, but it doesn't Bit what I want to work on, but I love the love, love the art. It's just gorgeous. It's like a dragon on the door and you can see space through it. If it doesn't sell, it's okay. I'll just keep it. <laughs> right? But I am trying to get my stash down to 50. So I, maybe I just have to go on a no-buy. I don't know. It might be a very long no-buy though, wouldn't it? <laughs> 
Next is another treasure. This is Virgo by Josephine Wall from Diamond Art Club. Yep, this is a collector. It's 70 by 87. It's discontinued. I think this one's pretty popular. So I actually bought this on a D stash about a year and a bit ago. So I'm going to be asking what I paid for it. So don't be shocked by the sticker on that. That's just how much I paid. Okay. <laughs> and another Josephine Wall magical meeting. I bought this also on a D stash last year. Everything is inside. It is 95 by 70. And again, I am only asking for what I paid for it out of the D stash group. So this will be, you know, listed down below with that price. So let me know if you are interested. Might be somebody's unicorn. So this is Jewel of the Sea by Hannah Lynn. This was a new release this year and it is out of stock. It is 65 by 81 and has fairy dust diamonds in it and it's super cute. I just don't know when I'm going to fit her in. This is a heavy box. And I actually have an opening for this on my channel if you want to go check it out. She's 65 by 81 in square. And this one's even bigger. This is Garden by the Bay by Joelle McIntyre. It came out about a year and a half ago. It's 118 centimeters by 70 and it is beautiful art and the sticker's not showing up very well so I'll throw a picture of the art here um, like I have for the others just so you guys can see the art. This is a square and it's super heavy. I actually have to put it down. Like, it's just too heavy for me to hold up. Um, so yeah, it's uh, got ABs in it. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, you know, it was a rainy day kit, but I don't know when the rainy day is going to come, right? Yeah, lots of those today. Next, we have Empower by Raven Philan. This is a square and it is 60 by 85. And this was a release, I think, in September or August. And it's super cute. Again, another kit that I would keep around for a rainy day, but maybe it would be better to go to an owner that's actually going to work on it or is wants to collect it. So there's that one. So next I have Spirit of Flight by Josephine Wall from Diamond Art Club. So I'm selling both Spirit of Flights. So I'm going to post this also in the Josephine Wall group. This one is 106 by 70 centimeters, and the Josephine Wall group is an event group that's open all year round. And so this one I also bought on a D-stash, so I will be asking for what I paid for it. This is a square. This is Winter Solace by Abraham Hunter. Abraham. <laughs> Abraham Hunter. I've been talking a lot today. <laughs> 88 by 70 centimeters. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah, it's a really nice one and it's square. And I also have Country Ladies and it's in this dragon attack box. So I'm having trouble getting this in my camera here. So this is this is Country Ladies. I don't have the box, but I have everything else. So I think it might be in stock, but maybe it's something you're interested in. Let me know. So this is, this is from Diamond Painting Shop. I believe this is Sleepy Time from Diamond Painting Shop. And it's a square. Let's see. Oh, it's super cute, you guys. It's got the sticker sheet. There it is. Yeah. It has uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ABs in it. 
A really nice sticker sheet, all protected. Oh, look at all those colors. Hmm, that one's actually really cute. There's a little fox and a kitty. And there's squirrel. They're really cute. It is very cute. This is by Sirio Marchetti. And it is 56 by 78 in square. This is from Diamond Art Club. This is a square. This is called Crows by John Ross McKimmy. It is 56 by 76 centimeters. And it has electro diamonds in it. It's actually pretty cool. Next, we have Fairy Lights by Ivy Dollamore from Diamond Art Club. This is also a square. I believe this kit is out of stock. It is 56 by 71 centimeters. It's super nice. Last but not least, I have another Josephine wall. This is from Uniquely Yours Down Under. And it is giant. I know somebody would love this for a project. It is 120 by 90 centimeters and it is Joy de Vie, Josephine Wall. It is licensed. It's huge. It's huge. I'll just go up. You can see all the detail is in there. It should have really good detail when it's all done because of the size, right? It's just absolutely massive. It's just massive. <laughs> So if you're interested in this kit, let me know. I can pull out the drills and send you a picture of those. It is in, they, they kind of came in baggies. It did not come in a box, but I can get a box for it when I ship it out. So it's protected. Yeah. So let's check the glue on it too, just in case you're curious. Let's pull it from here. So that's as good a place as any. It's so big. It has two layers of, yeah. This glue sounds good. So if you're interested in that, let me know. I will be posting all the Josephine walls into the Josephine wall glue, just in case somebody's looking for something. Otherwise, I can be reached on Instagram, uh, which is Andrew's Crafting with Diamonds, or you can reach me on my email, which is Andrew's Crafting with Diamonds at gmail.com. And uh, again, it's going to be all done by PayPal Goods and Services. And I'm going to ship it by Chit Chats Shipping, which drops into um, USPS in the United States. But it also ships, they also ship internationally, which is exciting. So if you're outside of Canada and the US, I can get you a quote. I'm going to be sending a kit to a friend in Denmark, and it was actually pretty reasonable. So please let me know if um, you need a quote. I have no problem sitting down figuring that out. I am currently uh, between jobs, so it's a good time for me to um, get that kind of information and spend time doing that for you guys. And I just want someone to do these. I, there's no point in having them sitting in my closet. You know, there really isn't. So anyway. Yeah, this is a big one. <laughs> She's beautiful though. I'm sure someone's gonna enjoy working on this and watch for surprises down in my list. I'll put the list up again here in the eye if I can do it. Otherwise, it'll be down in the body of the email with the description and I'll put my email and my Instagram link down there too so you can find me. Today is October 27th. I'm gonna post this tonight at midnight and I will be around all this weekend for any questions. Um, if you buy more than one kit, uh, let me know if you wanna make me an offer, if you're gonna take a bunch, let me know. I can see what I can do, but you know, a reasonable offer, you know, I will consider. And if there's anything really special from my stash video that you, it's a unicorn for you, let me know and I can think about it. But, uh, these are the ones that I've chosen to let go for now. But again, you know, that's just life, right? And I know that there's Christmas kits coming out and I gotta get myself a Christmas kit too. <laughs> Look, my nails match, isn't that, isn't that cool? Look at that. They turn like, they turn purple, depending on the light. Isn't that neat? Ooh. Anyways, okay, I better go now.
I'm too hyper. Bye for now. This is Zandy checking out. Please like and subscribe and all the things. Bye.